grand old partisan, celebrates more than 16 decades of Republican heroes and heroics. Today, I salute Jose Francisco Chavez, born near Albuquerque, June 27, 1833. This was when the region was part of Mexico. He studied in St. Louis and at the New York College of Physicians and Surgeons. Returning home, his interests turned to farming and raising livestock. Republican from the party's beginning, Chavez won election to the Territorial Council in 1858. Outbreak of Civil War, he enlisted as major in the 1st New Mexico Infantry. Gallantry at the Battle of Valverde merited him promotion to lieutenant colonel. Peace restored, Chavez won three elections for territorial delegate to Congress. A term as district attorney followed. He then served on the Territorial Council for the rest of his life, often as its president. In 1889, this, quote, acknowledged leader of the Republican Party presided over a New Mexico Constitutional Convention. Years later, a Republican governor appointed him superintendent of public education and also state historian. In 1904, he was murdered by an unknown assailant. After the largest funeral in Santa Fe to date, his body lay in state at the Capitol. Chavez County is named for him. Back to basics for the Republican Party is my civil rights history of the GOP. To quote the book, the more we Republicans know about the history of our party, the more the Democrats will worry about the future of theirs. For more information, see grandoldpartisan.com.